Can you paint high-density polyethylene? Have you ever tried to give a new look to an item made of high-density polyethylene, only to find that painting it is not as straightforward as you thought? This is because polyethylene, especially the high-density type, has some unique properties that make it challenging to paint. First, let's talk about why it's hard. Polyethylene has a low surface energy and is non-porous, which means it doesn't easily allow paints to stick to it. However, with the right techniques and materials, you can still achieve a good paint job. To start, you need to clean the surface thoroughly. Use a mild soap solution or a degreaser to remove any dirt, grease, or contaminants. After cleaning, rinse the surface well and let it dry completely. Next, lightly sand the area you plan to paint using fine grit sandpaper, around 220 grit. This step is important because it creates a rougher surface that helps the paint adhere better. Just be careful not to over sand as this can damage the plastic. After sanding, apply a primer specifically designed for plastics. Look for primers labeled as adhesion promoters or those formulated for polyethylene surfaces. Follow the manufacturer's instructions for drying times. When it comes to choosing the paint, select acrylic paints or specially formulated spray paints for plastics. These paints are flexible and durable, which is important because polyethylene can expand and contract with temperature changes. Avoid oil-based paints, as they can cause the plastic to crack. Apply the paint in thin, even coats. If using spray paint, hold the can about 10 to 12 inches away from the surface and use smooth, sweeping motions. Let each coat dry completely before applying the next one. For added protection, especially if the item will be exposed to outdoor conditions, consider applying a clear sealer designed for plastics after the final coat of paint has dried. Some users have found success with two-part paints like Surfacer 2000, which are specifically designed for better adhesion on HDPE surfaces. Always check the product labels to ensure compatibility with HDPE. If you're painting large items like storage tanks or outdoor furniture, consider using elastomeric paints that maintain flexibility after drying. This helps prevent chipping or cracking as the material expands or contracts. By following these steps, you can successfully paint high-density polyethylene and give your items a fresh new look that lasts.